Hello, it's time for Timberborn again. I have been playing for a second in between. Uh, I have no commentary on that. Well, on these two hours, but I will upload them anyway. But let's just see where I left off. We have 125 beavers in... in three districts four districts we are in a wet season but not for long we have water I'm just I, I'm just seeing what I was doing. I just totally forgot. Apparently I built a path here. I was building a dam here for some reason. Okay, so So I'm going to build a wall here, I suppose so that the water doesn't escape here, because if the water level increases here, it just flows over oh, this is to here. Supplies. Okay, so I think that this is what I, okay, I, I get it now, and I was building trees here, yeah. because I have no logs. I have locks over here, but not over here. I, I'm if seeing if I can switch. To, to the... There's this lonely little blueberry. This must be out of reach, right? Yeah, oh, what the stairs, okay. But we need to the logs first. Am I the only one that... I'm going to switch headphones for a second. No, audio is not working. I think I have to restart the game, which is annoying. Still no sound. I'm having sound issues. Yeah, the sound's back. Starting the game again.
Okay, we're back with sound this time. I put on my noise cancelling headphones because my wife was also playing the game in on Discord. So it's nice to hear the game without her. Well, without hearing her <laughs> talk about her game. Okay, the dry shift is still not down. Why aren't there blanks here? Is this permanent? Yes, it is. I guess I want to cut down these trees. It just takes way too long. Where are my planks going? Look, yeah, this is happening again. So eventually this is starting to fill, fill up. Because there is no exit for this water. The only exit is over here. So I do intend to increase this water height until here. And yes, this whole district will just be flooded. So I will remove it and I will move it on here. And then this will also be watered. Maybe I should lower this with some dynamite. Let's just add some dynamite here and food. So we have pears, we're missing potatoes and dynamite, dynamite. Oh, it's called explosives. It's a dynamite factory creating explosives. And then you put down dynamite. Okay, sure. create this path now and oh it's flooded okay fine then we can put a district gate here in the water and then do this and this village is flooded so let's just migrate the population for a second
So uh, 11 homeless and 12 unemployed. Also not great. Okay, let's build some houses here. Twelve house, twelve beaver. Uh, so let's build twelve houses. We also need plank for the stairs. I think we also need to create this. Otherwise the water will just flow here and here. We can pause this because the berries, well, they will grow, but yeah. it takes only a few days to get all these berries. But at least get so we have 15 unemployed beavers for some reason. So one and two is fine on these villages. Let's check the resources. We have a lot of planks, a lot of planks. We actually have a lot of everything. Except carrots. And maybe logs. Maybe I want more logs. Well, it's maxed. I should pass some buildings. And then export more. Well, there's nothing to export, really. I can use all the planks to create a new district, maybe. Yeah. Actually, it should be sand over here and here. But they cannot reach this because this is wet. This is flooded. Oh, well, let's do it anyway. They will send it later. Let's just send some oh, planks right. over. And logs. And add two more workers. And when the dry season hits, this will dry up again. See, the water is now flowing over here. So by building a huge dam right here. Which is, I think, the closest I can reach. I, I try to build it here, but it's too hard to reach. I have to build another district. So I'm first building it here, and then I will be building another one here. Maybe, I don't know. I'm just saving up the water now. I think I want to lock this up. Oh, fuck me. At 0.2. Why aren't they building houses? Oh, this is past. Okay. That's stupid. We only need four. Let's just migrate everyone back. There's only four jobs here. Yeah, I, want, I just want them there. They don't have a house anyway. I don't need these houses. I only need two houses because there's only four jobs here anyway. So 
So you have 11 unemployed, but they're mostly in they're here, right? Here. Yes. It's fun. Where's this mod migrating to? Okay, we have two of them for some reason. Maybe I intended to build something here and never actually did it. Okay, the dry season hit. I forgot to move this floodgate up, but it doesn't really matter. This city has... This district has plenty of water. It's 22 days. 58 beavers, yeah. They will be fine. They will also be fine. Oh, look, it's dry again. That's great. So we have one unemployed. We can just do this. So we have three unemployed beavers total. Yeah, it's fine. So this is a max capacity. We have only three jobs available in the theory. We only need three jobs because we have two children. They will grow up and then we have 57 working beavers and we can currently can employ 54. But I can just increase this number, like the number of distribution post workers and it will be fine. But I prefer to leave it unemployed. So when, let's say, someone at a farm dies, he will re be replaced. Okay, here we need a job, someone on the job. We have 15 houses, like 15 beds. So they can accept four more. Let's just migrate a few. We have one unemployed, so we can move it. Here we have two unemployed, for also one. Let's also move it. Okay. I don't want some. Yeah, <laughs> great. Okay, the stairs are now built, I think. Yes. Can we actually build the part of it? Maybe if I build some like a road like this. Let's see if it will reach. No, it won't. That kind of sucks. But at least we will be able to build this part and well, it will take a while. Maybe I just move the district building. Like, there's nothing to build over here. I could just move it to the right. So we have 13... 10 adults here. Let's just delete this. And move it over here somewhere. I think this is actually fine. Later I want to move it up here, but the, these stairs haven't been built yet. So let's just put it down here. Rename it. With a T. No, it's with a D. Okay, <laughs> is the range sufficient? Yes, it is. Okay, this like is fine. Now let's just move the beavers back. Because they all went over here. Migrate population.
Now we wait. Meanwhile, well, they are working right here. Let's check this side. So let's say I want to build a new district here. Where do I start? What about the bridge of full water from here to here? That would be nice. I somehow need to get rid of these trees. Let's just build this back so we can use the pass again. Then look at the range. Okay, I think I need to build some stairs right here first, so I can clear these trees and then I can build a bridge like this. Yeah, I love it. Then I can just do this somewhere. Let's just put it at the end. Yeah, that's this. the four unemployed beavers. Oh, they're here. Okay. I think I have to move this gate back here so they can actually work the lumberjack from here. I think this works better. Yeah, this one won't reach. Oh, it was still not reached the whole dam. Oh, yes it will. It's fine.
A booby average. How about your idea building a dam on the smaller gap? It will flood the entire bottom of your Amsterdam. Let's see. I suppose it's here. It, that's here. Yeah. It My current idea is to move water to here, to this lake. And from this here I can spread cool. it all the way to here. I so I can use this high ground. No, no more further. Here. Yeah, that's true. I can also do it here. Let's see what will happen. It's hard to keep track of all of this. Let's just build it first and see what happens. I mean building the bridge from here all the way to here will take a long time anyway. So I think you cannot Why? build from bridges, right? So let's just do this and then put the triple platforms next to it. Like this. And then I have, I, th I have to build a district for first before I can get there. That's no problem, I think. Well, we already have these stairs. Let's see the range. Yeah, it's fine. We can continue this. Let's just build down from here. Build a bridge. So this is the largest bridge without metal. It's too short. That sucks. No, wait. I think you can do this. So there's not really a point of building here on here. I can build on here, but it's also not very useful. But if I build here, I will flood it. Like, I will build a district here, then build the dam here, and then again flood the area. So, Mumia writes, yes, built a district there, and then you have lots of trees. Well, I, I'm not worried about the trees, I'm worried about food and water, because there is none. Yeah, we need so, to I have to bring it from here. Which is possible. I think I won't be able to build all the way over here. Would be nice though. I think it won't reach. There's no duel, maybe a little shorter. Like if I build a path here, I can extend it with two blocks, but... We will see how far we can get. I don't think these stairs will be built. Well, actually I do. Because this line is still not the reddest red, if that makes sense. Yeah. So this line will maybe get onto well, here, the, the, and then they still the have this range. So they will be able to out. build these stairs. Yeah. And from that point forward, I can just build the district on here. Let's see how Permarent is doing.
Yeah, nice and slow. Also very slow. This is a problem. We are constantly at the limit. Why aren't they clearing this building? Like there's 80 berries in here, why isn't this guy moving? Oh. oh, interesting. They won't move it out if it's lower than the desired stock. Then they just don't care. But the desired stock of this building is zero. But you cannot configure that. That's an interesting side effect. This guy isn't that unemployed here. He works at district center. He's just, they're just not clearing this building because there's already 20 berries in here. And that's a desire. Like, if I change this, I will do one the, once it is over. They will start pulling these berries out. They didn't fill anything up. See, it's all filled up until 20. And the rest just stays here. Look, there's 80 berries in here, and then I change this to 30. Look, and now they pull 10 berries to fill this up until 30. It's bad. This isn't how this is, should work. This should be uh, a desired level of zero. Lumia Riots built a large warehouse then. Yeah, but th there's space in here. They, they just this... go in. This is just broken behavior. This is just a bug. Sure, you can work around it by building a larger storage or just changing all of this, but it's broken. it's broken. Yeah, same for this one. Okay. This is kind of frustrating. So we have gears. We have planks. Not enough planks. And we have also no logs. Yeah, of course, because we are using them there. No, 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 I don't want to build this. This is too expensive. Because this is only a temporary district. Let's just build a large one. This. Mm -hmm. Yeah, let's just build a large one. Mumia writes, oh, now I understand why you're, what you're saying. My bad. It's all right. I just get... It's just a weird problem. Yeah, this one is now full, so it didn't really solve the problem. I just set the distribution limits, which is this. I just put everything on 100, and that obviously break when you only have one small warehouse. So the distribution limit should be lower. I'm not interested in changing this. I'm just going to build a second warehouse.
Like, n now the problem is just that this building is just full. Ah, okay. Well, let's just remove this. Nice. How far will it reach? Okay. So this is the limit. We can build a temporary district here. Let's build it on here. Districts must be separated by gate. Right. Makes sense. Okay, district gates. No. District center? Yes. And then I want a drop off point. And a large storage, because we know what happens if you don't have a large storage. This is annoying. Let's just do this. Hey, I can even do this. Drop a point. No, I cannot move this. I was planning to build it like this, but it's not possible. Well, actually it is. <laughs> Let's just build the district first with these beavers. Like they can, they can repeat all of this. Just Let's just build the district first, and then put down the district center. Yeah. I think it's faster that way. So we have a large thing, a water tank, which is always useful. We have water, this, a log storage. We also need a log storage. Yeah, sure. Why not? A mini lodge, maybe. Yeah. This is fun. I like it. Mumia writes, build a warehouse and basic needs first. Then you don't need to transport the goods to build everything. Yeah, you're right. That's a good idea. A campfire. Let's just build some houses. Like, how many houses do I need anyway? So we have only we have seven workers now, and we have four four jobs. Only four for building this. So we don't need more houses. Leisha would be fine. I actually don't care if they get social. I don't really care if they socialize. Like all the houses are full, so I can just increase the working hours. Let's prepare some stairs here.
So how's everything doing? Already building this one first. I actually don't like that. I don't really need this one. Yeah, I'm just going to ignore it. Well, they will complete it at some crazy. point. We can enable this one. Oh, it was already enabled. Three unemployed beavers? How is that possible? So, how is their well-being? They're missing some social life. That's reasonable, because... Actually, why? Oh, right, this one doesn't have any. And let's just build a campfire. So, who's missing the social life? This missing all as well as well. But let's just focus on these districts. So these are all pretty much maxed. They're only missing aesthetics. And some are and half social life. Why though? Do I have just not enough of these? We have campfires. Uh, these are houses. And, and a you campfire. Which is so weird. That's yeah, they're full. I think that's the problem. I can just build another one. Maybe like... Something. Somewhere. Let's just build a campfire right here. And then this district is missing also social life. Okay, interesting. Oh. Okay. Oh wow, they're really pulling the filling the filling up the building here. Let's just not do that. District gates. So let's just build some stuff here. I want to send over Logs, obviously. Planks. Planks. Some food, but not all food. And water. The autosave screwed me. Let's just add some... Bread, because we had plenty of bread, if I recall. We grilled potatoes. I don't want to send all the food yeah. because it will just fill up the warehouses. So close. Yeah. Unpause the building, put in two beavers. Let's just pause some buildings. We have plenty of paper. Okay, I can pause paper. We also have plenty of planks, so I can pass another planks. 
Then we can build a district center right here. Move some beavers. Should have plenty. We have three unemployed here. We have still one unemployed beaver. Not moving logs. Oh, oh, okay. So Permanent has its own water supply, so it doesn't need it, and it does need logs. No logs. Did I forgot to move logs? Yeah. Yeah. No, they're they're actually moving it. It should be fine. So we have still six unemployed beavers. Oh wow. Look at this. This is nice. the loud noise in my yeah. ears. I'm just lowering this doesn't need to but I think three three levels of water here is nice for the same reason I'd like to have three water levels of water right here speaking of three levels of water let's just decrease the well I didn't need to delete these pumps I don't know why I did that let's just put them back oh I want to decrease the water level here. And since these buildings are passed anyway, I can just do it right now. They should be able to reach this, right? Actually, sure. Let's put it in here as well. No. That's fun. Okay, we can read us up by oh. By cutting these trees.
So I don't get why we have 5,000 paper. That seems wrong. I think the ratios are off. Maybe you can build four or more paper mills to compensate. So we still have 279 grain. Dead. So let's just unpass one of these. And we have no flour. So these bakeries cannot do anything. I think we can slowly start to do spread again. Mumia rice not correct in the power grid. Well, there's no use really because I'm only using wind power. In the other save, it was useful to connect the power grid because there was mixed sources of power. Like we had water power, we had the beavers running, and we had wind power. But on this save, I only have wind power. So there's no use of connecting this these power grids because I can just build another windmill if I want more power. And we have plenty. Like we have... When the power output is like half, it's, it's 300 at max, but let's say it's half on average, it will still exceed nice. the amount of power required by oh, the buildings. <laughs> and same on this side, here we have plenty of power. Really Even power? though the output, is, okay, it's now pretty high, but we should have enough. And these windmills are pretty much free. You put them on the roof of something and it's done. Don't cost you anything. Doesn't have any upkeep, any resources. It's just put it down and you're free. Free power. So we survived the 21 day season. Almost, it's three days remaining, but there's no way we are losing any of the any of the beavers. So I think I'm set for 30 day dry seasons. I think we will be fine. This is annoying. So it's kind of sad I don't have access to the water. So maybe I should fix that. By building additional stairs. Maybe if I build some stairs somewhere, let's just build it right here. Yeah. Yeah, let's just do this.
Let's send another one here. And he can quite us quickly around in here. Yeah, we can even build under the water towers because pumps won't reach anyway. So we've built some stairs here. We have nothing to do in range. That's fine, let's just pass it. Oh, this is drying up. Interesting. Advice. Oh. So it took 20 days for this to dry up. Good to know. This was literally until like filled up to the how do you call fill up to the edge. Like it's overflowing. So it took 19 to 20 days to get from the max height to drying up. And there was even a single water pump running. So that's interesting. Okay, we can build these pumps again. One, two, three, four. I wasn't using them, but now I will use them because I will be deleting these. A water pump. And when, once these are built, I'm going to delete these and do the same thing on the other side. Basically lowering the ground to increase the amount of water caught in here. Okay, dry season, wet season incoming, new music, yay. So this path is not really needed. Can delete it. Because I will start filling up this area pretty soon. Instead, I want to build a bridge. Let's just do that. Bridge, bridge, bridge. I suppose it's uh, in here. Okay. Three. Oh, he's also. Sorry. So we need a bridge of three plus three. Bell, I don't want to build. It's oh, we have enough science to unlock it. I think we have enough signs to unlock everything. Oh no, we don't. Cool. 
Yeah. Okay, um... Eight. Oh, there's actually no way to get down there. There was, but not anymore. So I'm going to cheat by building this. Yeah, it won't reach. That's annoying. I still need to build a way down for now. Because they won't be able to build this one without this bridge. Or without these stairs. They only need logs. It is also being built. That's nice. Do we have food? Yes, we do. So the well-being is missing social life. That's because I increased their working hours. It's actually not that big of a deal. We have seven unemployed beavers. Let's check it out. We have one here. Yeah, that's fine. We have five unemployed beavers here. That's less fine. I don't like it. Let's build a What do I want to build? Maybe a little farm. Let's build some berries or something so they can self-sustain. But I don't really want to build any farms because I will increase the water height anyway.
boom, yeah, right, a builder's hut. Yeah, I was considering a builder's hut, but the problem with a builder's hut is that you need something to build. And this is also basically a builder's hut, and this guy is just sitting here because he's not, he has nothing to do. So you can build a builder's hut, but they won't have anything to do. That's because they're lacking resources. A lot of they're lacking resources because this building was full. And this building was full because this warehouse wasn't accepting new resources. And this one was accepting resources because the desired stock is 20. And we ex I actually need them to build this one. Or I have to increase the desired numbers here. So once this one is built, they will start receiving logs again. And then the builder's hut will continue, or the district center. And then I can build the builder's hut, maybe. It's kind of like these guys. Can you plant trees in the water? So they finished this, finally. So uh, maybe we can build a... Look, the locks are also pouring in now. Oh, they're also cutting trees. Yeah, a builder set is nice. Or a hauling post. Or both. Let's just first build the... Are they building? They're carrying stuff. I don't know if a hauling post will move stuff to things that need to be built. Like if they need to build these gates, will the hauling post move the resource to there so they can they can only build it? So the guys at the district center just have to move over there and start building it. And the hauling post already brought the resource there. I don't know if it works that way. 
Giga 85, right? I only think the builders do. Okay, well, we will find out. I'm just going to try the hauling post. And it's flooding again. There's not much I can do about it, I think. No, not really. I can lower this and put a blood gate here, but I don't want to. Once the dry season starts, it will it will dry up again. Lumia writes, yes, I wonder the same thing. That's why I suggest the builder set. Yeah, right. Okay, we will see. Let's just try the hauling post. They won't be building it until it dries up again. So we don't need to delete this one. Nope. Yeah, from this one. Then I can just do this. Done. This. They should be able to reach it, right? Yeah, they can. Because the builder's hut can act as a hauling post, but I don't know if they work the other way around. Yeah, all the resource buildings can move resources under idle time, but uh, they will do it less efficiently. So I'm hoping the hauler post will have their increased efficiency, like strength plus 100, to carry the resource to the well, building spots faster. Okay, dry season will start, finally. I think I'm only the one of the few that's happy with the dry season. Yeah, it's dry again. Yeah, they won't be planting these trees. I think I want this high priority, otherwise it will take too long. I don't really care about this, but they're almost done anyway. We have 12 unemployed beavers. Why? We have no unemployed beavers here, which is weird. Let's just pass something so they can start working the water towers again. Fifty-three with fifty. Okay. They just died due to old age, I think. So now no one is working the water towers. We have still plenty of paper, so let's just pass another one. We also have plenty of planks, so just pass another one. We are also having plenty of gears, so we can pass one of these. Until we're having undeployed beavers, I suppose.
Okay, let's see if the... Yes, it's here. Okay, let's see what they're doing. They're carrying nothing. Carrying water. That's boring. Not very interesting. I don't think they're doing it. What's he doing? Sometimes it's just wandering randomly. What's this? Oh, okay, that's just their idle animation. So they won't bring resources to builders. Building sites, so that's disappointing. So we might actually want a builder set. Well, I actually want the hauling post, but just one is fine. So, so many unemployed beavers. Now I have three in a boat here. Just weird. Oh, right. Just with the water pumps. This one is doing fine. Let's just unpause this. Unpause this. Just run my trees anymore. So once this is built, I. I'm just going to open this gate and see what happens, basically. Or I'm going, no, I'm going to lower this. 2.5. Then it will flow from here, down here. Then it will block here. Well, eventually it will just go around here and here. We will see what happens. This one is finished, that's nice. So now the water will go up onto up to this level. Maybe we can build a little farm here. Okay, the builder shot is finished. They're hungry. There's no food here. Oh, there is. They just didn't eat. I can put down a log storage so I they can walk. They need to walk less. And the hauling post can move it from there to there. How's the paper situation? Still a lot. Let's just pass them all. Until it stabilizes. We also have a lot of books. Hmm. 
Yeah, they're already cutting these trees. But, uh, they're all stored up. Are we exporting them? No. Uh, whatever. They're building it. Fast is doing, it's lacking logs. Maybe we can add some builders here. How's the storage? It's not full, so it's just a export problem. Like this one needs more workers. But we can fix that. We can give it more workers. Do we need to export stuff to Sandam? Permanent. Yeah, I think so. Well, no, not really. Do we need planks here? No. So we can put only two here. No, I want to. This one was actually fine. I want to decrease this. Right, I can remove these again. We also have a builder set with four people in it, which is totally unnecessary. This makes more sense. Maybe you have two of these. Yeah, this is better. Just waiting on the beavers now, mostly. Here they are building stuff. Here is stuff happening, but everything is fine. Maybe I can unpause a. Or just unpause this, whatever.
We have two unemployed beavers here. For some reason they're not building this. They don't care. I suppose it's because they don't have planks. Why aren't they exporting planks? It's so annoying. I mean, the planks are there. They're just not doing it. Wait, where are we exporting? To them. This is... This is them. There are no planks here. Oh, it... What? Oh, we're not exporting logs. That's stupid. I'm an idiot. Must have deleted that one at some point. This one is coming along nicely. Maybe I can just build this. So we have one, two, three, four levels of height. I don't think I want floodgates on both sides because it's harder to manage. I'm just going to put floodgates on one side. I guess I don't need a high floodgate. I can just do a tiny one. Maybe like this. Symmetry is important. Yeah, this should work out. I wonder if they can get there. Stairs for pay. Yeah, this should be fine. Let's increase priority on this.
Nice. I like it. Uh, now we can just delete this district, I suppose. Or I can keep it. So once this wall is finished, this whole area will be flooding and we can delete this. And we have this district, but it will be mostly... Well, the water, like the, the green area won't reach that far because the water will drain every dry season. So I guess I just have to observe the water levels for the next few seasons to see what's happening. This one is finished, that's nice. We can lower this one. I already did. I can... I guess I keep this one. Yeah, and then put this one at max height because I don't want the water to flow from here to there because this has its own water source. Instead, I want the water to flow from here down there. Let's just put this one at 2.5. And the next time, the water will flow from there into this and from this into this. And at the same time, the water will flow down from here into this as well. And at some point, it will just fill up until this height, which is the same as this height, which is still too below this one. So this one is too high anyway. The water might... Yes, it will escape there. We need a dam right here. Or a levy to prevent the water from escaping. One should be enough, actually. It's hard to measure the depth of water. So we aim for the height of this, this, this area. And we go two down. We go... If this is two below. This is one up. So, yes, this, this should be fine. Let's just create the path so they can actually build it. They will be able to reach it, so that's nice. The next path the water will escape is right here. It will actually go here, which is quite funny because it's the same water level as here. And then it will escape through this little gate. So the next part to block is this one. Just one level.
So this one should be 1.5. And I guess I should be moving the resources here before I actually do that. This one is getting nice. I should put down the path again so they can build the lower part and the upper part simultaneously. Now if I surround this area with levees and this area as well, I can build farms here by also increasing the water height. Basically like I did here, just put down levees and the area behind it will always be green. This one is done. This one is also done. This one is done. This should all be great. We're only missing this this one. We have eight beavers on it. And plenty of resources, so it's just a time issue. What's she doing? Is she drowning?
So this district is now completely useless. The water's flowing. I suppose I have to lower this so this district can survive for a while. Just not let the water flow there yet. Set folks on this area. So by putting down leafies I can let the water increase around it and use this area as farms. Which isn't great, but... Or maybe I should let the water flow here. So the water flows through here and then it can go around. Then I can use this whole area. Yeah, let's just do that. I think that works better. Guys, let's just increase priority on in this. So then we put Levy's right here. I think we need three spaces at least. this this can be much closer to the to the gates it should be more like this so one to three
Why did they stop building this? Is it out of range? No, it's not. Don't be so stubborn. Oh, okay. We have this single beaver going there. Okay, it's fine. I'm going to ignore this little area, maybe. Or I can lower this. Which is, which is, which is expensive, but... It's nice to have all this area. Wow, we barely had the time to fill this up. GK85 writes, starting a new hard mode game is pretty hard. If you don't get it perfectly right, they just die at the first rod. Yes, or the fifth one or the sixth one. I get it, it's hard. But I feel like the the long dry seasons are like once you're in this stage of the game, it's just not a real challenge anymore. I think you just need to build more stuff. It just takes a lot longer to build because you need all these walls to guide the water and still have the water available. Well, it's finished. That's nice. Not that it matters because it won't fill up in time. I don't know why exactly. Also I don't really want to because we're still building stuff here.
a lot of area to fill up. Anyway, I'm going to call it a day and see you next time. Thanks for watching. It's getting quite late here. <laughs>